Hold on now. What the hell is this supposed to be? Oh, dang it, Bill. What the hell you got yourself into? Here, have some. Oh, damn it, Bill. Oh, I don't like this stuff. Yucky. Mm. <laughs> oh my gosh, there's someone in there. Mm. Hello, hello? Hello? <laughs> myself in a predicament that is not good for me or my friend. Hello everyone and welcome back to another Dead for Dead video. <coughs> welcome back to another Left for Dead video. Today, I'm sitting in a box. I'm stuck in a box. They put me in a box. They are rehearsing me to record Left for Dead videos. I'm stuck in a box. Alright, enough with the shenanigans. Welcome to a Left 4 Dead 1 video today. That is what we are doing today. We have not done this before, actually. We've played Left 4 Dead 2 quite a bit on the channel. But I recently just got Left 4 Dead 1, so we're finally making a video on it. I just loaded up the game, right? And I'm going to be honest with you, loading this game up was not easy. Steam, if a Steam employee sees this, fix the damn game. I was just kind of messing around with, like, the audio settings and whatnot, and I saw the test microphone, and... I have no idea why my mic sounds so awful through that, but I thought it was funny enough to put in a video. It really does just sound like the Xbox 360 days. That's when I actually used to play this. This game is 15 years old. Can you believe that? This game still looks amazing. Just amazing for a 15 year old game, man. That's, that's crazy. That's older than some of you guys watching, I'm sure. But uh, enough, enough just talking about it. Let's actually get into it. It's been so long since I've played this game. And look at this loading screen. Oh my goodness. The last time I played this was like, honestly, probably like nine years ago. We're playing as Lewis. We have no mods installed, by the way. This is vanilla. I wonder if they still have it. Oh, they do. They don't have that in Left 4 Dead 2 anymore. They got rid of that because people glitching but uh yeah this left 4 dead one still has it i wonder i wonder does it still have the thing over here oh my gosh it does if you guys know you know i'm gonna show those off at the end of the video if i remember if i don't remember i apologize shoot him down shoot him down okay enough of that so uh as you can see everything is very different from left 4 dead one i'm sure some of you guys know about this one but i'll let you guys make your own observations while i play Oh my gosh, this is really good looking. I don't remember it looking this good, actually, at all. I remember this game looking a lot more, um, I guess blurry and, like, less detail in the textures on the 360. Last time I played this on the 360 was, like I said, like, 9 to 10 years ago, man. That's just wild. Maybe even longer. Honestly, I think it might have been longer. Yeah, it's been longer. Wait, no, no, that's actually around, that's, that's about right, actually, that's, that's about right. L look at this floor, look at the textures here, I, I just want to look at something really quick before we go, before we start killing. This is about what it looked like when I was younger, right? Everything was very low textured, there's, yeah, this is actually perfectly what it looked like. This is kind of what it looked like for Left 4 Dead 2 as well. Like, everything was a little more pixelated and less detailed, like I said so it could run on the 360 back in the day and it looks like this on the xbox one i'm not even gonna lie it still kind of looks like this and uh this is like the lowest settings but i just wanted to look at that but let's turn them back up because they actually look really nice all right we turned them all the way back up it, it looks you know you can see like the lighting and stuff on the floors and whatnot it's, it's pretty damn cool to me but uh we're not gonna speed run this we're just gonna play the game normally it's been so long. I'm, we're playing on advance, by the way. We're playing as Lewis because Lewis is flipping awesome. Control. That is a lie because I changed. Wait, does control still do it? Yeah, it does. I changed my controls a little bit because I remembered. I switched them to my Left 4 Dead controls. Fun fact: I actually use uh, C as a crouch. 
I'm left for dead too sometimes. I think it's shift and crouch. There's also a slow walk mode that I don't think is in Left 4 Dead 2. But man, see how their body, like only body parts will come off, but you don't see like the insides of their body at all. You just uh, shoot off their heads, legs, and arms. Oh, damn you. Get out of here. Dang, dude, this is really good looking. There's a boomer around here. That makes me nervous. And I always said this when I would play Left 4 Dead 2, is that I love how... Oh, I think we got a horde coming. Oh, we got him, we got him. Got that nasty boomer. Is I love how this game looks atmospherically compared to Left 4 Dead 2. Everything is a lot more darker and atmospheric. But Left 4 Dead 2 has better graphics, yeah, but... They, they nailed the whole atmosphere thing, and that's something that I think that Turtle Rock kind of had. You know, is actually decent at. I'm not going to say that they're good at making games, though. Because I've never, I haven't really enjoyed a lot of their games. But, uh, they definitely have a really good art style, and they're really good at choosing the right graphics for their games. And it, when they made Back for Blood, it was kind of... Oh wait, I forgot about the secret easter egg I should show you guys. Um, when they made, uh... Back for Blood? I was very disappointed. Look at this. Okay, can we see it better on this version? I think we can. Okay, so you guys see that right there? It's Team Fortress 2. Can we shoot this now? Okay. Yep. Now we gotta flip it. I just wanna be able to look at it. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, where are they all? They're all coming from there. Oh my god. There's a little Team Fortress 2 Easter egg on the back of that, which is also another Source game. I feel like a lot of you guys know that, but for people who are, uh, you know, don't know, I'm not hating. It's just a little Easter egg from another game that Valve has. Oh yeah, this one has no melee weapons. And there's no other pistols, it's just this one pistol. There's a hunter around, apparently. Can we stop them in midair like you can on Left 4 Dead 2? Got him, okay. Also, cool little detail, look at this, listen. It actually has sounds. That wasn't in Left 4 Dead 2 for a while, I think they put it in a few years ago, but it wasn't in there for a while from my memory. Oh man, a lot of special infected. Oh yeah, there's less types of special infected on this version, but I'll tell you one thing. There's a lot of them. Get the secondary pistol here. There was no limit on how fast you could shoot these fucking things. I'm just not really that fast. Okay, we got a horde. Let's test it out in the horde, shall we? There's no limit on how fast you can shoot these things. Hey there, Francis. Merry Christmas. This is a room that I hardly go into. Even back when I used to play Left 4 Dead. One thing I love about Left 4 Dead is that when you'd go off track into areas like this, you'd be rewarded for it. And in Left 4 Dead 2, they have some of those, but they're very obvious, like, check this out type of stuff, you know what I mean? I also don't know if the same strategies work in this version like they do in Left 4 Dead where you can like destroy the tongue while it grabs you or if you can kill the smoker while it got you. I don't know if you can even stop the hunter like mid-air like you can in Left 4 Dead 2. Also we could talk in this one. Look at how fucking good this looks man. 
This alleyway is just so iconic to Left 4 Dead in my opinion. I know that's so random, but it's so damn good looking. It's just so good looking. I love it. Damn. The, the ragdoll, or whatever it's called. I know people get upset and they call it something else sometimes. I forgot what they call it. I'm going to call it the ragdoll. Oh, the ragdoll to their bodies. It's just, I wouldn't say more detailed, but it's more fun. They just freaking flop like a fish. They go on the deck and flop like a fish, you know? Oh, somebody help me! So this thing out here, there's a boomer out there. I think I should turn off those subtitles. I just turn it to subtitles only. So, I can't quite see where, you know, know exactly where everything is. Oh, there he is. We got him. Should we, let's do it. Let's do it. Oh, listen to the sounds. Everything sounds so different as well. I love it. Sorry, Bill. Did not mean to shoot you. There's no melee weapons, so you couldn't just stop them. I think you could push them back as much as you wanted, though. They eventually die. I think they actually take damage from it, but, you know, not as much. They might take a little bit of damage in Left 4 Dead 2. I don't, I don't know. So you can stop them, but it's a little weird and awkward. They also have different animations for when they fall. When they get pushed, which is kind of cool looking. They look like a real person just got pushed. Also, fun little detail. See how the, cl the toilet is closed now? We're going to close this. Look at all the kills we got, man. 141. That's just some pro shit right there. Alright, remember that thing I told you to remember? Now it's open. Look at that. The toilet is open, my friends. It's a cool little detail I've noticed. I don't need to heal. I don't need to do none of that. Look at the safe house door, it looks pretty different. What do you guys like, Left 4 Dead 1 or Left 4 Dead 2 more? I know some people actually do prefer Left 4 Dead 2, uh, 1 more than the second one. And I completely understand that. The game is very atmospheric, like I said. And I like it. kind of funny the second we learned about this we all take this way we hardly go the main way anymore watch I bet there's something up here oh no I was wrong I was wrong seems like hunters have a lot less health we're gonna get any new weapons here I'm gonna give one of them some pills just so you can use it for later Look, we even got some more pills. Hello. What's up, Doc? Seems like you're constantly fighting in this version. In terms of horde. But in Left 4 Dead 2, like, there's a lot more, like, times where there's less hordes. So this one, I think we fought, like, probably four hordes of them. Guess that was a good spot for it. Also, their bodies don't burn on this one, I don't think. They just kinda... They start in fire, but they don't, like, turn black or anything. Yeah, I just saved myself last second, baby.
We're getting a lot of supplies here, though. Here, hunter somewhere. I think they see him. I'm trying to give somebody pills, man. What's in here? You gotta see something? What are you looking at? Bill? Weapons here. Just another pistol. And they don't have, like, the, the Desert Eagle in this one. It's just these two. We haven't found an upgrade to our guns yet. Does that take a little bit longer? Because I, I know Left 4 Dead 2, they changed quite a bit about these original maps. Oh shit, we got a tank though. We got a tank. I just saw someone fly past me. I think that was Bill. Sorry, that was my fault, wasn't it? Bill? Oh, shit. Francis, no! Who oh, helped Zoe? I got him! I'm just shooting the shit out of him. Okay, Bill just teleported. Nice. Uh, Francis, we lost a good man today. It was kind of my fault because I shot him. Francis? <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, their freaking bodies ragdoll too. I don't know, do they pick up the stuff that other survivors dropped on this one? It's almost like I can still hear him somewhere. Nothing. How the hell did we get to him from here? Is there something over here that I never noticed? Huh. I don't really come over on this side very often. Interesting. There we go. The tank had so much health. Somebody help, somebody help, somebody, somebody help. Kind of wish that there's a realism mode on this one. This body was so fun to mess with. Because if it's ragdoll, it would never stop. Bastards. Give them to me. There's a witch around here. Am I gonna have those pills or no? Thank you. There's a witch and a hunter. Careful here, I can't see very well. One thing about this is that the lights actually were pretty good mechanic in this version. These are all the three main weapons. Better weapons. Oh man. You know I love this one. Dang it. I thought I could dome her, but I couldn't. Not necessarily dome her, but just like, uh. Do some damage. Thanks. Weapons over here! Okay. Oh, okay, I'll just use my pills. I know about the temporary health boost. Bastard. Okay, let's just get it. Let's just do it. Let's just do it.
What does that mean? That I threw 20 of them? I haven't played this game that long. This is a good strategy to survive underneath there, by the way. It must be mean all throwables or something. But right here is a good place to stay, because, uh... Yeah, you, I mean, think of it, there's only smokers and hunters that can really grab you. Smokers can't really get to you down here. This is a good place to stay if you're just doing survival. Being selfish. Got him. This thing heats up a lot faster, I think. It also blocks your view when it smokes up, that's kinda cool. I don't think Left 4 Dead 2 does that. Not that I can think of. Heal him already! Oh my god, Zoe. Do it! I hold him down! Goodness. Okay, she did it at least. She did it. Boomer is vomited on Zoe. Good for her. Out of her. Help, 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 help! I'm gonna take some more pills. Seems like the pills kind of wear down a lot quicker than, you know, other things. Oh no, the helicopter is here. I saw you go in there, friend. Got him. You know, another thing to note about Left 4 Dead is I don't know if it takes place during the fall or winter or something, but everything is dead all the time, like the plants are. Trees are dead, freaking everything is just dead all the time. So I don't know if the virus actually had something to do with that or not. There's a safe house! Shut up. Did they get rid of that? I gotta set off the car alarm. I can't hear it. Help me, fellas. I'm gonna stay here until this horde is gone so I can listen to the damn piano. See if it works. I don't give I don't care about your safe house. There's also some more supplies out here. I don't care if I'm being selfish. I don't wanna listen to the damn piano. Every part of me hurts. Shut up, Lewis! I'm gonna kill you. They got rid of it. They got rid of the piano.
Why do I still hear a helicopter too? I'm so disappointed. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna make it. I'm gonna heal now. I'm, I'm disappointed. Why did they get rid of it? That was a thing in the first one, was it not? Or am I crazy? Dude? Is this just a false memory? I know in Death Toll, you know, you could play the piano. Just looking for extra supplies, cause sometimes they're out here, but don't look like it. Good. No, no, no. Help! There's a thousand of them. There's a thousand of them. Okay, get your asses inside. We made it. Sorry that I made you guys suffer. Zoe, what the hell? You're freaking out. Zoe. Francis. Why are you looking at me like that? Where are all you looking at me? I'm some kind of leader. That's what I think we should do, is just shoot those. <laughs> Alright, should we just get going? Let's go. We got no time to waste. Boing, boing, boing. Pipe bombs seemed a lot better in this version than they do in Left 4 Dead 2 in some aspects. I think it's because I feel more panicked in this version than I do in Left 4 Dead 2. When they start coming at me like this. It's a little more stressful. Hello. We're getting closer to the ending. Bam. <laughs> I smell wagons. Dead stop. I got an achievement called Dead Stop. Lewis thinks I'm funny. Why don't you guys laugh too, huh? 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 Alright, let's go. I like to jump. Get your asses on right now. We can't jump when we're on this. That's kind of interesting. I love the sounds that they make in this one as well. Look at the way that the, they their blood turns into mist. That's just so damn cool. Bill, it's nice knowing you, but you're a sacrifice. You was a sacrifice at the beginning. This whole time. Sorry, Bill. That was unnecessary. I just killed you for no reason, basically. Oh. Wreck a flaca? Okay. Y'all. I mean, Zoe and Francis. <laughs> because Bill's dead. <laughs> Why are their limbs not coming off as much with this? Oh my gosh, dude, this is wild. I got a little too cocky and I sacrificed Bill. That was that, that was just literally unfunny. That I didn't even need to do that. Oh 
my gosh, please survive. Help me. Shoot the smoker, help me. Help me, guys. No way. I'm alive. I'm alive. Come on. You gotta get up. Look at this fat bastard. <laughs> Weapons, don't worry about Francis. There's weapons on the ground now. All right, Zoe, I'm gonna heal you, and we're gonna make it through this apocalypse. She's just shocked at everything. I was the one who killed Bill in the first place, and now she's just terrified of me. She's like, if if it comes down to it, he's gonna kill me. There's only two of us. It feels a lot more stressful than it would in Left 4 Dead. No! Left 4 Dead 2. I'm getting all. The what? What is the sound of these achievements? Guys, it's the reincarnation of them. So it's the reincarnation of bit of our friends. Why? Well, I'm just getting achievements like non-stop too. Why do they sound like that? Oh my gosh. I'm getting so many damn achievements right now. <laughs> Please. Do you guys see how fast I give those pills? Can you guys stop being big babies? Full blown babies or whatever you, you people are doing out there? I like how they close the doors behind them. Also, look at this. You can open that. You look so fucking pissed when you do that now. I don't know why. They're like, yeah, I know it opens, but don't do it. You're gonna get us killed. Like, I'm not even playing on versus when I do it either. They just get pissed off. Like, you damn idiot! You're gonna get us all killed. Like, that doesn't even really do anything. It just opens. Also, look at that tank. Grenade! <laughs> so many goddamn achievements. Zoe, I will shoot you if you get in my way. Sorry, Francis. Now you got a bullet in you. Oh great, Zoe's dead. There goes another sacrifice that I can't use. Oh, he died. Zoe, no. Boing boing. Weapons. Weapons. Lewis is a psychopath. Hey guys, pipe bombs. Isn't that lovely? I don't even know if we killed anything doing that. Oh, mama. Where the hell even was he? Good for you. Oh, you're in here. Oh my god, Francis is dead now? Weapons over here. Where is his body? Billy, you're so terrible. Like, you can't even... Oh my gosh. They're just dying. It's actually a lot of my fault. I don't know why I'm trying to put the blame on them. Don't put the blame on me. Don't put your blame on me. Milk. Milk in the sewer. I wonder. 
Is it expired? Or can we still drink it? I didn't even think he grabbed me. That was funny. It's not blowing their limbs off like usual. I remember like blasting the blims off. The blims. This fool, we he's been reincarnated. Okay. Let's throw that up there. We're good. See how they don't shoot them in this version and they actually let the pipe bomb go off so they don't waste ammo? That's so cool. Get out of here. <laughs> Not a chance. Hello. There's so many up here. So damn loud, too. When they beat the piss out of you. Taking this. Groovy. Hurry, everyone. Move it. Come. Hurry. Hurry. Anything good in any of these rooms here, though? Probably not. Okay, come on then, Bilson. Bilson? That's his real name. I don't know why I did that. I didn't have to do that, but I wanted to. Like, something, something inside me just clicked in my brain that said, Kill Bill! I mean, don't kill him, but just put him down. <laughs> ah, we're back. <laughs> hey, Bill, how's it going? How's that boat wound doing? Sorry, Bill. I'll heal you. I feel bad about last round. Not really. Dead giveaway. Dead giveaway. Thank you, Bill. Hello. <laughs> Well, that TV's gone. Nobody's ever using that TV again. Not during the apocalypse, not ever, not after the apocalypse, not everything's back to normal. That TV is gone. Hey guys, watch this. Yeet! Clearing out these damn rooms, I'm tired of these zombies. Look at his buttocks. Just kidding, don't look at his buttocks. YouTube, do not look at the zombie buttocks. We do not want to get demonetized. I, I had never have played this. Like, I never got in trouble for playing this level, so. We're good. My teammate will deal with whatever's happening down there. Oh my goodness, and I'll deal with this. <laughs> You're dead. Hee 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 hee. You want to see a cool little detail? Look at this. More water falls from the roof. When you shoot out these windows. Not just rain, but like these little streams here. We can ignore her. She's just being a bit... I guess edgy. 
They're, they're actually slow walking, that's kind of cool. I wonder if that affects how she acts. Zoe, so you didn't even have to do that. You're just actually insane. We made it, we did it, we did it. She's alive. Thanks, We're all okay, fellas. I'm the one who hunts, remember? Stairs are a good workout. I do. There's like nobody around here, that's kinda ominous. Look, there's patient zero. Kids around here, fellas. Oh, but there is a boomer. All right, we're gonna activate this. We're gonna run over here. Get your asses in here. Come on, y'all. Get in here. Get your asses in here. Bill. We're safe in here. Stop opening that door. We need that door closed. It'll protect us. 101 cremations, eh? Eat Luigi! Oh, you'll be fine, Zoe. We'll make it to the safe house, don't you worry. Can't tell if it's open now. Must be. To the elevator! Okay, it is open. Oh dang it. They usually say on Left 4 Dead 2 if, when it's open, even when they're not near it. So I actually really like that. It makes you have to actually come here to see. Get in. Get your asses in here. Reloading. See, I love this. Except they can't even get in in this one. I don't remember this being here. Uh, they must have patched this out at some point and realized that this was like a bad idea or something to have that open. I don't know why. I think it's a cool idea. Like, it's not like they're going to get in all the time anyways. Ready for this? <laughs> Good jinx. <laughs> You lucky when I shine a flashlight in your guys' eyes, huh? I bet you don't like it very much. I don't know what that is. 
I'm getting so many damn achievements. Wild. Yahoo! You can't even see land, like you can in Leopard did too. Good, we're good. You do damage to them while you're down? I didn't know that. You can't do that in Left 4 Dead 2. I forgot about that. Thanks, man. Man, this hurts. I'm with you. That was a My bad. Sorry. Sorry about that. Oh, man. Sorry. Bro. Boom, dia. Boom, dia. Hold on, let me patch you up. I can heal myself. Don't you worry. It can only get better, right? They're doing it themselves, Bill. Check this out, though. Bill, stop. I'm literally just trying to make us survive and save ammo, Bill. Don't understand. Grenade. Bill. Reloading. Please. There we go. I like how the fire looks in this one. They're all in sync, that's hilarious. Is that a hunter? That was a hunter. Interesting to see that. Okay, let's grab this final mullet tool and let's go. Also, in Left 4 Dead 2, uh, the ammo that you can carry for the shotgun is 90 and not 128. It's just 90. So I find that interesting. This version, you carry a lot more ammo for a lot of guns, it seems like. It's fun to make them ragdoll with this. Mercy Hospital. Okay, let's see what this looks like. Oh yeah, this is different. It's time to remember it.
I think this also has a hallway back here. Yeah. I always tell people, like, I remember this being a hallway. And they're like, what the hell are you talking about, man? They all get pissed off. <laughs> Guys, get in there. In the, in the hallway, this is like the best place to survive. Holy crap, here they come! Is that in him indicating that he got bit? Oh, fuck you, Francis. I wonder if that's what that means when he says he had an incident. Because in the next level, which we're not going to be playing during this, uh, that's Crash Course. And, uh, at the start of that, he, uh, it's like a helicopter crashing. I think Zoe shoots the pilot because he's infected. And <laughs> Bill's like looking at me like, what the hell are you doing up there? Like he double checked to make sure I was actually up there. <laughs> I remember the first time I played on PC. This was one of my first PC games actually back in the day. Funny enough. Somebody help me. Dang, dude, look at all the blood on you. Is it yours or mine or everybody else's? I'm not down there helping at all. This one, it really feels like teamwork is way more important. One hundred percent. I think he knew he was gonna die, that's actually kinda sad. Maybe I can do some actual damage to him now. Sorta. Of. Let's go, my friends. Go, Francis. I got you. Let's go. We need all you alive. We did it. We got all of us alive. No one left behind. We did it, y'all. Look at them zombies. They don't know what the hell is going on. They're just confused. They don't know what's going on. Dang, dude, this is very nostalgic to play through this again. I don't really got anything else to add on except thank you guys for watching. 
mercy killer. I got like every single achievement that the game has, I guess. Just going through that. <laughs> I don't think I got every achievement, but I did get quite a bit. No mercy. Oh man, this brings back memories. I remember being in elementary school and uh, watching Left 4 Dead videos after school on Newgrounds. Yeah. And uh, on YouTube, just animations. And uh, th this is just very nostalgic. I think one of the most nostalgic maps to me personally is probably Dead Air. That one I played in so much on Left 4 Dead. And it's just very nostalgic to me. I remember when The Sacrifice came out, I think. It was very cool. But this this just brought back memories of me playing uh, on the laptop. My stepdad set up a laptop. And uh, he got Left 4 Dead for me. And I remember playing Left 4 Dead on this laptop, and I played it quite a bit. But you want to know something funny? It was my first PC game. But you know what I played with? I played with one of those touch pads things. Not a mouse. I played with the touch pad. And I was able to keep up with people online. And, uh, I just remember loving this game. Left 4 Dead 2 is very nostalgic too, but this one, I think, is just the most, you know. I don't care much for this title screen and what they've done with it since I played it, you know. But it's still the same game, you know what I mean? It's still a lot of the same stuff. The level design is what I remember it being and whatnot. And I just remembered something that I was going to show you guys some glitches at the end of this. And that's what we're going to do. We're going to look at some stuff to No Mercy. That's all I remember though is the stuff for No Mercy. Well, it doesn't matter who I am. I'll be Lewis. And I remember my laptop had broke, like the charger port had broke, and I couldn't play it anymore. And, uh, when that happened, I wasn't able to play Left 4 Dead anymore. It was the first Left 4 Dead and, and the second one. But I'd kind of, I'd play both, you know. And I wasn't able to play the games for a long time until I got my 360, which had Left 4 Dead 1. And a few years later, I got Left 4 Dead 2 for it. And, uh, then my 360 got stolen. I'm not trying to make anybody get sad. But my Xbox 360 got stolen when our house got broken into. That just that stuff just happens, you know. It, it sucks, but... I mean, here I am playing it today, and I'm having a blast, so it's really not a big deal. I'm not trying to make people feel bad, but that's, that's what happened. And, uh, I was very sad at the time. I couldn't play things like this. Um, I met... One of my best friends that I'm still friends with since elementary till this day over Left 4 Dead. I met all my best friends through this game and it makes me Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, that's not funny. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. It just makes me really nostalgic, you know. But uh I met another friend named ZB Master on Xbox a while back and uh, they taught me how to kill witches with one hit with a shotgun and I talked to them back in 2017 and they had a family and I it's just crazy you know we hadn't talked for years and I talked to them and they had a family I need some help. Uh, and I asked them if they remembered me and they're like yeah of course I do I could not explain to you how happy that made me they one of my other best friends that I'm still friends with to this day. Um, Ducky. I think they go by. I'm still friends with them. And I played with them back in middle school and elementary. 
But uh, here's one of the glitches, by the way. I'm just kind of talking about random stuff now, but... Yeah, you can come down here. You just chill out. Apparently there's a bunch of pills at one point down here. Also, isn't it interesting how they do still spawn down here? There's apparently pills and stuff in this little room here, but... I've never seen that before. But yeah, this is a area you're not supposed to be in. They kept it in the game, probably because they were fine with it. Because it's not... You're kind of dead when you get down here anyways. But I think it's interesting that this truck just has this part to it. But... Yeah, I remember me and my friends coming down here and just... Playing Left 4 Dead, chilling out in the glitched areas of no mercy. Sorry, I kind of went on a... I, I kind of rambled a bit, but... That's cool. See how there's detail even... This is like the skybox, I think. We've walked all the way to the skybox, but this area makes me so nostalgic. You can't do this in Left 4 Dead 2 anymore. They have an invisible wall that kind of slides you, so you can't do it. You were able to for a long, long time. But, uh... Apparently, they still update that game and get rid of glitches. So, uh... Yeah, the developers know it exists. So that's interesting. Makes you wonder about other, any other games that they know glitches about, like Team Fortress 2. They haven't updated that game or added anything to it for in a long time. And uh, this is just such a damn cool map. I mean, look at this skybox. It's so cool. The moon is huge, though. That, that is a little weird, but the graffiti that they set everywhere, the... The darkness of this map for Left 4 Dead 1 is just, it's perfect. It's iconic. It's just one of the most beautiful source game things I've seen. But like I said, Dead Air is the most nostalgic to me. Because I remember spending a lot of time playing that. But uh, one of the, oh god, I had a heart attack. I had a heart attack. I thought there was somebody standing right there. But it was the fan. That's actually scary as hell. Look at that. I wish I could zoom in, but that is scary. I don't remember that. <laughs> I, I, I didn't really pay attention to stuff like that, but... Just the detail in this level is very beautiful. But, uh... Like I said, Dead Air is my favorite. And I just remember coming home every day watching Newgrounds animations like, uh... Oni. I think he made some. Yeah, he made some Left 4 Dead and uh, a bunch of other animators. And uh, it makes me happy to know that Newgrounds is still popular and they make animations with similar hu humor on it. It's always nostalgic to come back onto there. But uh, anyways, one of the reason, one of the ways that they stop players from coming down here is that they knew people would jump onto here, you know. So there's a kill box right here that just kills you instantly. Because they knew players would jump from, you know, the top onto that truck and probably survive. So they are like, let's just put a kill box. Wait, why does... Why do I have a shotgun already? Wait, that doesn't make sense. I didn't grab it. What the hell? What the hell? Here's another thing that Left 4 Dead definitely knows about because they got rid of it in Left 4 Dead 2. Uh, I think there's a way to survive still until this day if you get on there, but this was the easiest one to do. You jump onto there. You skip this entire building section. And then you speed run him. Are they still up there? No, they're trying to get through the building. And I'm just ahead. Shit. 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 I'm leaving them all to die. Sorry, I'm just having fun with this now. I don't think the smoker can get me. They can try to, but they can't get me. There used to be a glitch, I swear, that where the smokers could get through that little hole there.
What if Lewis actually just pulled some stuff like this? Like he just jumps off the building, he's like, guys, come on! Also, one thing I really like about this is if you reload, you have to grab a bullet for every single, like, time you reload. <laughs> Unlike Left 4 Dead 2, where it auto-fills your ammo once, and you only have to press it once. Hunters are adorable little fellers. But anyways... That's it for this one. I hope you guys enjoy. We'll see you on the next one. Peace out. Be safe. And goodbye. He's here.